Hello everyone, it's Michael here with Goody Reader News. Open e-readers have been the trend so far in 2014. An e-reader running Android is a very compelling value proposition because a lot of e-readers from Kobo, Amazon, Sony, and a myriad of others you are locked into a particular ecosystem. You don't really have a whole lot of choice uh, on what bookstore you want to deal with or what reading apps that you want to use other than the ones bundled on it. Onyx has been putting out a fair number of e-readers this year that have the open Android concept. So you could load in Amazon, you can load in Barnes & Noble, you can load in Eldico or Moon Plus Reader or even FB Reader, um, Comixology, whatever apps you wanted to install are now very easy. Now with the Onyx Books Newton, it's actually easier than it's ever been before. This is a six inch e-reader that actually has Google Play built onto it, which means that you can download, you know, about 500, 600,000 apps from Google and install these apps right on your unit. Now, obviously with Google Play, there's a lot of games there. None of this the C-Reader won't work with games. It's ma mainly a gateway to being able to deal with the ebook company that you want or to deal with, you know, whatever a third party reading app that you want or even installing Adobe PDF Reader and going to town with PDFs. Uh, it's a very interesting e-reader. Um, it features um, e-ink Carta, which is the same sort of page turning technology that the Kindle Paperweight 2 and the new Tolino Vision have. Uh, Carta, is very interesting. You know with e-readers in the past how you turn a page and then you sort of see that full page refresh and then the newer generation e-readers um, you don't see that full page refresh every page it's every six pages but still it's um it gets you sort of out of that spirit of reading a book with Carta, you don't actually see the full page refreshes at all. And if they do occur, it's every chapter. So you can actually read like 30, 40 pages seamlessly. And this is the new technology with uh, um, the Onyx book Newton, which I really like. Uh, resolution's about the same as the other ones, 1024 by 758. Um, they actually say that the front light technology on this is called Moonlight, which I actually thought that it's, it's kind of an interesting marketing ploy because front light is front front light front lit is not really a real word but moonlight is and so they can actually use this marketing across the entire fleet of devices um, I thought that, that was just interesting uh, other than that it has a 1 gigahertz processor of uh, 8 gigs of internal storage and SD card support it's only running Android 2.3 though, and a lot of more modern reading apps require at least Android 4.0. So this may not run the cutting edge reading apps or comic books or manga apps out there, but an open e-reader is an open e-reader. And this is the first e-reader that I've ever seen that actually has Google Play shipped on it. And the open Android concept is really compelling here. Um, it's going to be on sale for about $199 uh, US, but it's about six. 6,990 rubles and it's a top of the line e-reader. It's not on sale yet, but it will be hitting the streets uh, in Russia fairly shortly. Unfortunately, they don't ship outside of Russia. So we'd have to wait to uh, people start selling them on eBay and things like that uh, in order to purchase one. For Goody Reader News, my name is Michael. YouTube.com slash Goody Reader is the channel name if you're watching this on another website or channel. That is where we have over 920 videos. We do lots of contests. We take requests. Uh, we have lots of news blasts, discussion, round table discussion, even though our table is a square or rectangle. And uh, lots of drive time videos with your yours truly, right her. And lots more stuff on that channel. And of course we do requests. So if you guys have anything you want us to film or have anything you want us to talk about, let us know and we will try our best to accommodate.